think I'm going to do jet airliner. It's another one, when you play these songs, it's hard to get back from the mouse click to over here before it starts, but bear with me if I miss those first three kicks, uh, forgive me. And I'm gonna play this over here. <laughs> There are no extra charges for clubs that I threw in there, and uh, still getting used to playing lefty. 
uh, not lefty, sorry, left hats. Um, so I messed up a little bit here and there. But uh, that was one tape through. Uh, basically, I did run like hell and then followed it with Jet Airliner. I didn't take any breaks. I didn't uh, redo anything. It was all one take. Um, so any mistakes I made are made. And um, please uh, go ahead and give me any criticism you have, anything you might want to say, anything, anywhere you think I could use some improvement. Um, the reason I chose Jet Airliner, it's, uh, you know, it's not the most complicated song, but uh, like Run Like Hell, but it's got some hi-hat work in it, and I've really been trying to, to get that, and hopefully uh, it came across a little bit. Towards the end there, it's almost like it's just constant lifting and, and you know, opening and closing. Uh, I don't even know if he had planned it out. Whoever the drummer was originally, sorry, I don't know his name, but um, he did some great drum work for them if it was all the same guy. Uh, it's pretty bad there. I don't know his name. But I'm going to end the video here, and I'm going to cut this into two pieces, I'm sure.